chimes. So we are 593 now, folks. Thank you so much for those um, for adding to the match. Reno. We are going to go into our next set now, though, which is of course going to be Sora versus Palu, Jen versus Helper, and we are right back to Town of City. Yep. So Palutena, you know, such a great, consistent character. Uh, probably going to be one of the characters who can really contend with Sora's just really awkward movement and. Um, Disjoints. Yeah. Uh, Palu has the speed, absolutely has the disjoints to deal with, um, you know, Sora just hitting your shield. A lot of characters have a lot of issues, you know, hitting that, um, the Nair on shield, hitting the forward air on shield. Palu is not one of those characters. That fair has a lot of range, um, as well as just, you know, Nair out of shield, catching any sort of mix up with a cross on. Yeah. Albert just enjoying some stage control right now, just yeah. running back and forth, baiting out the auto reticle. Wow. Ooh, I love the idea right there. Casting the absolute latest on that landing hover. Okay, they're not able to go super duper deep as again. Uh, Tora absolutely has the ability to go. I think you're dead. Ones. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. you're super dead. Absolutely. Um, Sora got that weird Mario back throw for some reason. And we got a helper with a Sora uh, up a stock right now versus Jen, who has been performing very, very well. Hasn't been coming to a whole bunch of Xenos due to Super Duper recently, um, but has been going to like Stargate out in Jersey mm -hmm. and other tournaments uh, pretty frequently. Has been performing very, very well. Jen sort of getting back into his game once more. That was, ooh, that wasn't true. There's no way. That was DI out. Where is your air dodge helper? I think maybe Helper thought he could uh, land on that platform and get his shield yeah. out, maybe. Yeah. Okay. Hold on, though. Ooh, Helper's okay. still in an excellent position. Already at 82% is Jed. Okay, Re doing a quick read on Helper's jump-in. Has been doing a lot of jump-ins after the Thundaga um, and just going for... I'm actually surprised Helper wasn't able to make that back. I think Helper did not max that up quick enough. Looked like he's had some time to act out a hit stun there. Mm -hmm. uh, Palo's downer is, a, is deceptively... Wow. Okay. We got downer combo. Speaking of, oh, you died. Oh, oh just barely. <laughs> okay. Jen had the idea, waiting out that counter. And yeah. Helper in a pretty bad situation after the start of this game one. Yeah. The adaptation from from Jen has been so 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 good. Okay, and we're back to stage again. Okay, yep. looking for that third one. I like you, you can spot dodge. Um, Sora side bees, and it really allows you to get past any sort of mix up. Oh okay. my god, what if that just killed? <laughs> what if it was one of those counters? Across the stage. <laughs> Alright, but Helper right back in this game, though, yeah. bringing things right back to even. Oh my god, you nearly died. And that's like, unlike Palu, Sora can go all the way off for those stocks. And after, you know, what was a huge uh, comeback from uh, Jen, uh, Helper has responded in kind with all of this damage. You give Helper some space, it can be brutal. Helper, oh, yo, these boy, we're going all the way off to kill Sora. Okay. Helper right there looking for a reversal. You saw him aiming the up B the other way. Oh my Didn't god. get the full hits of the thunder. Okay, and that's the thing. Hero can absolutely stall on that ledge as long as he wants. Ooh, barely gets around the back air there. Nice Great parry. parry. If you parry Thundaga 1, you can absolutely get a punish. Anything after that, you're, you're not punishing Hero. Alright, there's a re-grab. Jen just taking stage control, waiting for Helper to come in. Oh my god. Yeah, gosh. that time I think yeah. that Thundaga was a little bit too obvious. Looking for an explosive flame oh, this right is a re -grab. there. To Oh, that just barely whiffs, and both players are going to get back to stage safely here. Helper utilizing the ledge so well to his advantage. <gasps> Miss Tech! Oh, oh and the dash attack just flat out beats out the back air, gets underneath it. Um, Sora does low profile quite a bit with that move, and is able to get underneath the back air to take the stock. And that was such good patience, too, by Jen. Oh my waiting god, that was for so the, uh, close. Wow, hold on. Look at that, just barely getting underneath the back air. Oh, hold on. Just barely getting underneath the back air there to take that stock. Um, excellent work by Albert. Did that move have intange? Why do I feel like that move has intange? I'll, I'll check, I'll check. I feel like it does. Um, with that said, though, an excellent utilization of Dash Act by Helper, allowing him to get that stock. Was up a lot at the beginning, was down a lot in the middle, and made that big comeback at the end to take the stock. Yeah, huge swings in momentum in that game one right now. Now we're seeing Jen's counter pick of Battlefield. Already looking pretty good from Jen. All right, can confirm Sora Dash Dyke, no intent. No, no intent. Yeah, that was just, just low profile. profile. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> 
So after uh, after it was you know pretty excellent bit of uh, work there by Helper. Oh, utilizing the neutral beat a stall just above uh, Palu explosive flame and allows Helper to get back to stage. Even a conversion out of it too. Upper has to use the side piece to get back. F tilt will uh, be taking it for yeah. Dan. I think that last side beat was a little bit ill advised. Could have probably just gone for two and gotten back to stage safely. Mm -hmm. Yep. Now Helper playing from behind, getting some nice re jumps right there. Look that at the end That would have killed. Oh yeah. Has to deal with Helper coming back to stage right now. Yep, and Battlefield, you know, Jen's gonna be getting so many Palutena teleport cancels off of that, and mm -hmm. also, you know, the, the feints for it. Yeah, but that fair to the floor, don't think that one was true, didn't really look it. Um, however, just able to punish with the forward smash there was Helper. We're getting back to the stage, that counter excellent utilization of that by Helper. And again, Dash Tech beating out the back end. That's so good for Sora. Mm -hmm. Nice, an excellent use of that second angle that you saw. A, a slight angle just to make sure he stalled just long enough to get past Explosive Flame. Yep, great timing there by Helper. Now has to get off of the stage, or wow. off of the ledge again. And yeah, that time, you know, Helper, I don't, we haven't seen Helper go for many reads on Jen's uh, platform cancels just yet. We'll have to see if that starts to, starts to come into play. Gets an, ooh, another down tilt. Yeah, and even though Sora is so, so good at recovering, you can sort of stall forever. Um, Palu downed with his active for like 12 frames. Yeah. Uh, that, move, that move is tough to get by. Yeah, it doesn't matter how long you're stalling. That down tilt's still going to be there. Ooh, looking Going for a hard read. Yeah, and, and Jen taking full advantage with a big Palu combo here. Not overextending either to get hit by down air. Really excellent work by Jen just to maintain stage control. However, helper in stage control here. Jen has to get back to the ground and some platform cancels to get out of that situation. Excellent work. With the counter right there, Jen not able to get the uh, auto reticle. And again, uh, I feel like Sora just doesn't really have the horizontal mobility to be able to catch these um, these platform cancels. Jen's getting real comfortable with them. Ooh, down air not enough just yet. Helper absolutely needs to take the stock off now though. Does catches the upbeat of stage, and this is not that terrible of a position for Helper. Oh, you can't gotta be a little bit more careful with those jump. I think that was that was a counter. That, that was counter. Helper that that was counter. Yeah, that yeah. was counter on the blast one. But holy moly, Jen went all the way deep for that one. That was a jump. Is that an SD stock? Like, is that like a suicide? Is Paolo getting bad? Uh. Is Palu getting back? Uh, you have to drift in with the bear. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say barely, probably. maybe. That's a lot of distance to get back to stage. If that misses, Jen, Jen would have had to go like high and drift to ledge, but I think probably. Yeah, that it's gonna be close. That's for sure. Okay, how are we gonna get back to stage there safely? Um, going into this game three, we are gonna be on Hollow Bastion. Not going to be able to get the uh, double uh, uh, dip there with a the down air. Ooh, knocking the final hit of the Makes it unsafe. However, not getting punished. Yep, shield poke there on the up tilt, but not able to get too much out of it. Just going right back into neutral. Hubber trying to get some of those loops started. We're getting just a little bit. Not not too explosive uh, just yet on this game three. Just little, little hits here and there. Jen already making use of that uh, middle platform for the platform cancels. We saw him do so much in game two. Obviously not going to have as much room in game three on Hollow Bastion. Ooh, that's a huge counter to get back to stage. Jen was not ready for that. Look at that F smash read. If those haven't been working out for Helper, we definitely will not want to see him go for those anymore. Just maintains that stage control. Thundaga was a great mix up there. Absolutely looked like Helper was going to go to ledge. And Palu loves to sit on top of ledge there. So it's a great, great mix up for Sora. Ooh, barely getting out, but not Bear is enough, and Helper's gonna go with the stock lead. Oh. I love the recognition that back air right there wasn't the play and able to get the up air. So Jen keeping things super even right now. Well, that uh, that uh, up tilt from Helper is so good. Catching a lot of out of shield options from uh, Palu just because it does have a little bit of a low profile at the beginning of that move. Nice counter to get at a disadvantage. Goes for another one, doesn't end up working out. Okay, Jen now retaking that lead. Ooh, okay. Don't think that would have sent off stage, but still an excellent idea by Jen. The awkward win box situation right there. Jen does get back down. Back down. 
Thundaga coming out. Ooh, okay. Those counters now becoming a little bit predictable. Jen holding shield just a bit more. All right, poking the up B there with the forward air. Okay. I love the idea using the uh, Faraga to get the get the space to start up the side B. Yeah, and we're just seeing, you know, both players adapting really, really well to how the other player is playing. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're able to cast that deep um, recovery there. Oh, we dead? We are just barely off top. So, so is Jen. Now we have last stock situation here. Helper taking his time getting back up to the floor. Last stock, game three, zero okay. percent. Helper getting the first hit right there with the grab. Yeah, and the good thing about um, uh, Sora, uh, Barry, even when you land with it, you sort of low profile a little bit. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna be able to get back to the, down the ground, and you know, even though a, a Nair was baited out on the missed up air, um, okay, that's damage. That's damage. Absolutely. Ooh. Just getting hit by the last hit of the neutral air okay. right there. Helper off stage again. Okay, just going for the two. I like it yeah. right there. Ooh, that wonky box of the Nair almost enough. Both players in dangerous positions here. Oh, and Helper's gonna get those side B's getting a, barely getting a lead. Looking for a platform cancel that time around. Gonna miss it. Helper trying to wait for when it mattered most. Okay, we're back. Oh, but drops from ledge there. Oh, oh my gosh, what a mix and a half. No, you're not dead yet. Yeah, no, not even no, close. No, no, no. That would have been it, though. Okay, dash attack still not enough just yet. Jen going for the chase. Both players, their absolute last legs here. Wow, and it pokes. Poking. Okay, jab on the shield. Okay, we're jumping away. Good. Using the Blizzard to stall a little bit. Oh, the stall! Okay. And the drift back from stage, and Helper gets back to stage just barely safely. Back door's not going to be enough just yet. Nor's up throw. Oh, they dropped! Both players on their absolute last legs That's here, and a dash is it. enough! The mix-ups from Jen in the corner were so good. So, so close for Helper. However, it's going to be Jen just barely coming on top in a Game 3 situation. That last dash in was a little bit ill-advised, but you're trying to catch the landing from Palu. Jen just with a great mix-up. Jen cheesing <laughs> and a, a little great, bit. He's like, I, may, I maybe shouldn't have won that. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, ends up being that Jen takes it over Helper. Excellent work overall. A great set. We've had two great back-to-back -back great Game 3 sets. This is what New York has to offer. Helper is a great player. People don't know who he is because, well, we know who he is because we love Helper. But we do. This is hilarious. Double SD. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> But, uh, you know, helpers, you know, really can give people run for their money. He is quite the strange person to fight against. If you've never fought against Helper, I recommend it. Um, you will learn some things about Super Smash Bros. you did not know. Um, and with that said, though, uh, both players, excellent set. Mm -hmm. We are going to have to cut to a break here really quickly. Uh, one of us might be off. We don't know. Right, one of us might. We might both stay on. Who knows? Who knows? With that said, though, folks, make sure you are, of course, following House. And we'll see you real soon. Stay tuned.